Hi, everyone. Welcome to volume 15 of The Blast Out. I'm your host, Amanda Moore, and we have a lot to cover today. But first, I want to start off by saying I have my one of my favorite sweatshirts on, Pensacola Beach, Florida, for a couple of reasons. One, it's cold here in Oklahoma, and I'm wishing I was on the beach somewhere. And the second reason is, um, if you've been following the weather at all, you know that area down in there, specifically from what I understand, Panama City Beach, um, got hit with some terrible weather and have uh, they've suffered some damage down there. So please keep everyone um, there on the coast in your thoughts and prayers as they recover from this and everybody else that's experiencing uh, crazy weather right now um, all over, all, all over the place. Uh, we have some Arctic air getting ready to, from what they say, it's going to hit us this weekend. So batten down the hatchets, guys. Uh, I am not prepared for this. I'm not meant for the cold. So, uh, but anyways, like I said, we have a lot to cover. So I'm just going to jump right in. Uh, New Dog Old Tricks podcast with hosts Bryce and Brennan. They now have their website up. It's running. They have a, uh, a pre-order going on for a t-shirt sale. Um, and half the, half the profits of this t-shirt sale is going to be donated to Beaver Dam Fire Cadets. So jump on, pre-order your t-shirt now. It ends February 1st or um, until they sell the first 100 t-shirts, um, whichever comes first is whenever that sell stops. So um, head over to newdogsoldtricks.com for more information there. And as always, I will have the links to everything that I'm discussing. It's going to be in the comments um, after the show. So uh, moving right along to fire conferences, January 12th through the 14th, County Roads Fire Conference in West Virginia. It's the 2024 conference going to kick off Friday, January 12th with a hands-on search class with lead instructors, Thomas Anderson, Sean Duck, and Chris Kessinger. Later that evening, they're going to have opening presentations and a social event at the event center. Saturday is going to be full of presentations from Sean Duffy. Uh, he's going to be doing victim removal, Robert Ramirez with Mayday Mindset, and Andy Starnes, the ultimate house fire yours. Lunch is going to be provided on Saturday. Sunday was uh, will feature a presentation in the morning from Jonah Smith, Firefighter Rescue Survey, and a grab-and-go lunch as they close out the conference. So if you are in West Virginia, make sure to, um, in or around there, make sure to get registered for that fire conference. Uh, they're also going to have vendors set up. It's going to be on hand throughout the conference. Friday, January 19th at 7 p.m., Brews and Tactics with Bobby Eckert at Union Beach Fire Code Number 1 in Union Beach, New Jersey. Get registered and catch Bobby talking about aggressive engine company operations while supporting the Union Beach Fire Company. Enjoy some brews, prizes, and tactics. On uh, February 3rd, you're going to be able to find Corley Moore and Kyle Romagus in Michigan at the Kalamazoo Fools Winter Seminar and Bash. Register now if you haven't already. It says, um, I pulled this straight from, uh, from their site, revamp your leadership and firehouse culture with insights from Corley's class, the nine L's of leadership, then get ready for that afternoon lunch knowledge bomb to drop as Kyle Romagus presents an educated systematic approach to fire attack and nozzle work with cruel intentions. February 20th, if you're in or around Lansing, Michigan, Get registered. Delta Township Fire is hosting a full day with Corley Moore as he presents two of his classes. He's going to be um, presenting the nine L's of leadership and followed by repercussions. That's his new class that um, that he has now. So it costs only 50 bucks and you can go to deltami.gov for more information there. February 22nd through the 24th, Orlando Fire Conference. Pipes and Drums will kick up kick off the conference, followed by keynote from FDNY Chief Frank Lieb with instructors to include, but not limited to, Frank Viscuso, Bill Gustin, Dr. Candace Ashby, and a whole host of badass hot tracks. Many which are sold out, but there are still several to choose from. So if you haven't already registered for Orlando Fire Conference, you're going to want to do that. If you're anywhere, if you live anywhere where it's cold, get the heck out of there, go to warmer places. February 23rd, from 8.30 a.m. to 12, right here in Corley's own backyard, Midwest City, Oklahoma, Midwest City Fire Department has welcomed Corley to present his class, the 9Ls of Leadership. 
The mission of the class is to give people the tools they need to build a high performance culture within their organization. Corley is extremely passionate about this. If you know him at all, you, you absolutely know that passionate is the word to describe him. He believes that uh, understanding these principles can challenge anyone, anywhere, to improve the culture of their department or their organization. The presentation is broken down into nine principles of leadership, all of which start with the letter L. Learn, listen, love, look, laugh, level, live, labor, last. The ultimate point of the class is to provide them with the single greatest tool that, he, that Corley can give to someone in the leadership role. And that is a lens by which they can judge every decision around the firehouse before they make it. Corley says firehouse on purpose and not fire ground. March 21st through the 24th, one of my favorites, Daggum Fire Conference in Texas. They're going to have the pipes and drums open up again this year with a lineup of incredible instructors. I just read on Facebook earlier that they um, announced Corey Thompson's going to be there, uh, as well as Babel, Basil Ibrahim, Robert Marez, Steve DeRusso, and the Daggum Hot lineup, which is going to have Bears the Oath, No Quit Writ. Spouses are encouraged to attend this fire conference with their firefighter. April 15th through the 20th, everybody already knows the biggest fire conference in the world, FDIC. So many amazing firefighters and instructors attend this conference year after year. You can find the entire instructor lineup at FDIC.com. I'm excited. Corley's excited. He's headed back for the third year in a row. He's going to be speaking on Thursday, April 18th at 10.30 a.m. Head on over to FDIC.com for all the information there, as well as more information on all the instructors. They've already rolled it out, um, the, the times in which the instructors are going to be speaking. Um, rooms are to be determined from what I understand as far as like where they're going to be speaking, what classroom they're going to be speaking in. Things can change. So uh, I'm sure as it gets closer, they will roll that out. June 12th through the 15th, Great Lakes hot. The last I saw this morning, there was one spot left for the Search Academy with lead instructor Cody Trestrell from uh, Brothers in Battle. The It may have already been sold out by now, by the time I do this blast out, but members of Build Your Culture and Twist of Fire Industries will also be assisting with the program. If you have a passion for fire, for the residential pr primary search, then this is the class you want to attend. Two straight days of everything related to search in a fully furnished two-story house. They do have other tracks that are open. So if you didn't get in on that um, hot track with Cody, uh, make sure you check it out and get registered for one that is available. Check out all the conference information at the link, uh, build your culture. Uh, I will have the link in, in the comments, like I said. Before I jump off here, I just want to take a quick minute to share a couple of things that are near and dear to my heart. One is... Uh, Firehouse Vigilance, Corley Moore, and Cornerstones of uh, Leadership, Frank Lieb, had just announced their giveaway for both of their books. So it's going to be a book combo on the giveaway. So head over to Firehouse Vigilance on Facebook or Instagram and Cornerstones of Leadership on Facebook and Instagram and get registered for that giveaway. It ends, I believe, midnight of the 17th. So it's gonna run for a week and the winners will be announced on the 18th. They're doing five of these. So there will be five winners that will um, both, or all five will win um, a hardback of each of these books for a two book combo. So again, five winners. Uh, I think all you have to do is like, like their post, follow their Facebook, like Instagram, um, share it, tag them and make a comment. Uh, I believe the comment is, um, hashtag cornerstones of leadership, hashtag nine, the nine L's or something like that. So anyways, um, run over there to their, to their social media pages and check out that giveaway and get in on that. Um, that's a pretty cool giveaway. And then I'm super excited to announce, um, if you follow me at all, 
which I don't expect you guys to, but if you do, um, you will have already seen that I share, um, Corley and I are writing a book together and it's been a labor of love and, um, yeah, just making sure that we get it right. That's the important thing is, um, that we get it right. We are, um, you know, getting ready to celebrate, uh, 28 years of marriage. No, oh, 30, 29 years of marriage. <laughs> don't even know. At this point, you don't even know. You just forget. But um, so this has been, we've been together 30 years. So this has been 30 years in the making and uh, we don't take it lightly. And so, um, but it has been confirmed who is writing our forward. So I can now share that and um, feel really honored um, that they have taken part in that. But Corley and I have our book, Broken Tools that is going to be released um, February 14th, hopefully Valentine's Day. So if you've ever written a book, you know that um, the release date uh, can change. So um, it's not rolling out as quickly as what we had thought maybe um, initially, but that's okay. Everything happens for a reason. It's on its final edit now. And we have had so many incredible people um, that have read this book and edited it for the better and um just not enough words to to say thank you to to them and um but yeah so be watching um for broken tools to be released um coming up in the days weeks ahead so all right anyways guys that wraps it up no guests today join me next um month we decided we kind of revamped um the blast out what the future of that looked like moving forward. And, uh, as you know, with this, um, it's ever evolving. So it just kind of creates and grows a life of its own. So, um, right now the structure is doing a blast out once a month. That way I can, um, compile the information. I'm not hitting you guys with the same things over and over. Although, um, I absolutely enjoy sharing all of these conferences, um, any chance that I can get, uh, but without just inundating you guys with the same, the same ones over and over, um, every two weeks, hopefully this way I can, um, get a rein in on that and start featuring more conferences that uh, maybe you guys haven't heard about, or that hasn't gotten the notice that they need. Um, so if you have fire conference information, if you have donations, raffles, anything that can benefit our firefighters and their families, please email that to me at fhvpromo at gmail.com. I try to pull as much information as I possibly can when I'm on social media, but um, it, nothing is better than hearing it from the person that's putting on the conference or somebody directly related to it or somebody that's come across that information and making sure that I don't miss it along the way. So again, guys, thank you so much for your time shared with me on the blast out. Uh, look forward to joining me next month where I will have a conference guest who's going to be sharing about an upcoming conference. Um, all right, guys, we'll talk to you later. Happy New Year and um, have a great rest of the week. Stay warm if it's cold where you're at and enjoy the warm weather if it's warm where you're at. All right. Talk to you soon. Bye, guys.